Hello and welcome to Ivy Times TV. Today is Monday, September 12th. I'm Maurice Christian. A defunct seven-ton research satellite is falling to Earth due to re-enter the atmosphere soon with the potential to rain debris onto the Earth's surface. According to NASA, the Upper Atmosphere Research Satellite is expected to come down to Earth by late September, early October. NASA says safety is their first priority and the risk to public safety is very small. So small, in fact, you have a better chance of winning the lottery than you do of getting hit by orbital debris. The satellite is expected to make a crash landing on Earth, filling a 500-mile wide range of land across Britain, Europe, northern Canada, southern South America, and three oceans. Once the 20-year-old satellite re-enters Earth's atmosphere, NASA will be able to project with more accuracy the general area within which it will land. One of the problems when predicting the landing spot is the fact that the satellite will break up once it enters our atmosphere. Pieces of various sizes, the largest probably 300 pounds or the size of a refrigerator, will fall on land or in the ocean. This satellite is 35 feet long and 15 feet in diameter. The bus-sized satellite weighing nearly 12,500 pounds was deployed in 1991 from the shuttle Discovery. The $750 million UARS satellite has been dead in orbit since 2005 when it was decommissioned after a 14-year Earth observation mission. NASA says there is a 1 in 3,200 chance a person will get hit with debris, and they encourage anyone who might find a piece of the satellite to leave it alone and call their local law enforcement authorities. Marisa Christian, Ivy Times TV.